Welcome guys to another episode of the Extra Mile. My name is Alex and welcome to another Star Citizen episode. And we are right here in front of the moon Selen in our Prospector, which is a mining ship. Uh, look at that beauty. And yeah, I'm not usually a miner in uh, space games like this. Um, I don't know why exactly. I do like uh, to haul cargo. That's usually my kind of thing. A little bit of exploration. But since ship buying is in game it, I was actually able to buy one of these. Um, I thought, well, why not give it a try? So that's why we're here uh, on Selin, or in orbit, around Selin. And we will now fly down to the surface. And mine some rocks and see how that works. I have watched a tutorial, um, so I think I roughly know what I am supposed to do. And we will figure the rest out when we get there. Nah, it's okay. Um, yeah, here we are close to the surface. We should maybe break just a little bit so we don't destroy our ship. We can see quite a few rocks here on the ground so I think this is uh, this is probably a good place to start so let me show you guys something awesome so the landing animation or rather the animation for VTOL mode ah look at that isn't that nice so the first thing that we have to do is scan for mineable rocks and we do that by hitting tap and we get into uh, scanning mode we then hold our left mouse button until it says 100 percent release it and we send this ping out which did nothing <laughs> so let's try this again hmm don't seem to be getting any results here so we might have to fly somewhere else all right fly somewhere else hmm Lots of rocks around, but I'm not getting any results whatsoever. Oh! 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 We got the... We, we got something! Okay, it was somewhere around here, so let's uh, load up that scanner again. There it is. Okay, so this is a mineable rock. Wait. Oh, 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 we have an orange outline shale deposit. Calculating instability, calculating resistance. We see the mass of the rock. It's titanium. 2.1% titanium. Alright, so let's start to mine. Okay, energy level. So, in the bottom left corner you see rock energy level and we have to get into the green zone, which means we need more flutter on the laser, which I can control with the mouse wheel. We're at 100% now. Okay, we have to flutter down a little bit. Do more, more, more. Okay, 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 okay. This is tricky, this is tricky. This is not just a matter of point and click, you really have to manage your power levels here, which I like. So on the right 
corner, bottom right corner, you see that overcharge sensor. If that reaches 100%, the rock will explode and potentially damage or even destroy the ship. And above that, you have the fracturing sensor. We have to get that to 100% to get the rock to uh, basically break apart so we can then extract the mineral from it. Okay, giving it a little bit more juice so we get back into the green zone. But just a little bit. I like this. I like this already. I can tell that this is good fun. First I thought finding these rocks would be much easier, but you actually have to, you know, fly around a little bit check out a few places to, to find one. That alone is cool. It's kind of like a treasure hunt. Alright, we're in the green zone. Give it a little bit more juice. Look at that. That looks pretty awesome. Okay, we're getting really close to cracking the rock. Did not work, I believe. Oh no, it did work! Oh, that's awesome! Yes, it does work. Oh, look at that. That is so pretty. Um, oh, there's another one. Alright, so... Um, my game just crashed and um, there's a weird bug here at the moment that you can't reclaim uh, your ships once they are destroyed. So the prospector is gone, unfortunately, including its cargo that we just mined. But um, I had so much fun. Let's buy another one and try it again. All right. Uh, here we are in mining ship number three and we are in an asteroid bel uh, belt around the moon Yella. Uh, as you can see it's quite pretty around here and I thought an asteroid belt would probably have well asteroids so let's uh, try to find something here that we can mine and hopefully not crash before we sell it because I would like to sell it um, yeah let's see okay so as before the first thing that we have to do is scan Okay, so that didn't work. Oh, that was close. Okay, so far nothing, but we will keep trying. Oh! We got one! Okay, we actually have more than one. So let's, uh, we have three, we have quite a few. Um, let's fly there. All right, there it is. Okay, let's not crash. Okay, we have titanium and aluminium in this rock. Or only titanium, I'm not quite sure. Let's see what happens. Caution. Front collision. 
actually not a small rock. Let's take a look here. Look at that thing. <laughs> it's roughly as big as, as my ship is. Um, okay. Let's do it. Mining mode engaged. So, we can see there asteroid P-type, whatever that is. Okay. Lots of aluminium in there, so let's do it. Okay, I'm starting to throttle up the laser very carefully. Oh, that is so pretty. Man, that looks good. I don't know why, but I really like this. I really like balancing the laser throttle. It just feels very good. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Overcharge, 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 overcharge. Oh no, we have to back up. Okay, something does not seem to work right. I can't throttle my laser back or up. Alright, bad news, guys. I seem to be stuck in my seat. Uh, the controls are bugged, so I can't do anything right now. But, uh, we tried mining and... I gotta say, it was pretty good fun. That surprised me a little bit. Um, I hope that my ship will still be there when I restart the game next time so we can do some more mining. Or maybe we will get another patch and um, yeah, I will definitely try this again. We're not done with mining. I'm really surprised how much I liked it actually. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching guys. I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.